Good morning, everyone. This is already the Vintage Stitcher. Today is Sunday, September 19th. Um, I had good intentions of filming yesterday and the day absolutely got away from me. So today's video is all about you guys. Um, I did, I, we did the drawings for the 4,000 sub celebration that we did on Tuesday. So today is all winners and happy mail and there's a surprise bonus at the end and all sorts of stuff just for you guys. So there's no stitching today. I have nothing to show you. I'm in the middle of a few projects from the weekend that I will update you on in a later video this week. So today's video is all about winners. Um, and I know I, I, I've mentioned this before, I really struggle with time management. Um, I always feel like too busy for my mind, my body, and my time don't ever seem to be in coordination with each, each other. Um, and I struggle with giving myself grace in that area of my life. I always feel like I should be doing more, producing more, making more, working more, getting this done, getting that done, babysitting, have a job, I, I just feel those struggles that I know many of us do. Um, and sometimes we just need to come down from that and go, okay, is it really the end of the world if the TV doesn't get dusted today? Or um, if I don't stitch today? Uh, as much as I love to stitch every day because it, it, it soothes my mind, what happens if I don't? The world does not stop. So before we get started with the, the winner's of this I want to take I think I showed this once before I I picked this up this book um, at a library sale over the summer and it's um, tapestry of life and it's different poems um, that kind of just maybe just give you some time to ponder and think and whatever and of course I cracked it open and the one I cracked open today was um, a poem from Sister Miriam Barker and it's called stop look and listen and it says stop and look and listen for you are richer when you do and never miss the special gifts that God would share with you stop just pause a moment and you'll know it's best to pray just keep some quiet time reserved you'll have a better day Look, for all around you, you are, for all, for all around you are such lovely things to see. And God will show you heaven and a glimpse of what's meant to be. Listen for the wondrous sounds that often fill the air. And sometimes hear a whisper sent from heaven to you there. Yes, stop and look and listen. For you'll find that when you do, that all the peace and joy God gives are surely meant for you. So, <clears throat> whether you're a believer in God or some as or any anything else, um, I, I I'm not here to preach the word or Christianity or God or anything, but I think it's a good lesson to um, for all of us to be able to stop and um, smell the roses and enjoy what's going on in our world and give ourselves grace when not everything gets done in a day. It may take a week, it may take a month. Um, but there are things to stop and look at and see and smell the roses and enjoy it along the way and we all need to remember that. So hopefully you enjoyed that poem. Um, okay, I'm gonna adjust my phone because it keeps sliding. So sorry about the hand movement. I need to invest in, sorry about that, the phone just went woo, um, and I'm not a good editor. So usually what you see is what you get when you see my videos. Um, so on to the winners. <clears throat> winners, winners, winners. We had lots of winners. Um, the video did amazing. There were so many, so many comments on it. I We had 583 comments on that video alone. Um, so I pulled some bonus stuff for you guys but let's start with number one number one the vintage the vintage stitcher mug cup that my mom made 
and it comes with this it's so super cute um i have talked to my mom she's starting to agree to a doing a, a video with me so we may get to see some of her work um later this fall they're busy camping right now so they're probably going to be camping until holiday time and then um then they'll slow down a bit so it might be later this fall <clears throat> this is number one deb hire hair h-e-y-e-r deb you are the winner of this um this cup so i think i have your address but um, everybody, if you could, and when I call your name, please email me your address below so that I can get this all boxed up for you and get this shipped off in a timely manner. I want to get it all shipped off um, this week so that you can enjoy all your prizes. <clears throat> so, Deb, congratulations. You're the number one winner of the grand prize. Okay, so number two was the coffee mug, the vintage Stitcher coffee mug that my mom made. This was dual-sided. So, number two, Margaret Hay, H-E-Y, Margaret, you are the winner. You are the winner. All right, so number two. Number three <clears throat> was this little November chart and some Hall Halloween floss drops and project tape. These are homemade by me, so... Lots and lots of fun. Number three, Glee Hansen. Glee, send me your address and I will get those out to you. Yay, yay, yay. Number four was the owl, which is super fun to um, stitch. And I should have grabbed it so I could show you. I have mine stitched up. It was super fun. And this little hay pumpkin. Um, this was my little crafting from last week and I had some extras, so. Number, this was number four. Joan Menard. Joan, you are the winner of number four. So please message me your address. Yay, yay, yay. All right, number five was We Autumn and another little cute little pumpkin hanger from my craft room. Number five. Number five is Donna H. Donna, please give me a message. Now these are all user handles, so um, I know sometimes the name is different than the user, so Donna H. Number six, it was the Bewitching Stitchin. How cute is that? Now this chart has been loved. Um, it's not written in or anything. It's a little crinkled and wrinkled, but it's still very, very usable. And then some floss drops and project take. So, Number six was Diana Marinuccini, Marinuccini, M-A-R-I-N-U-C-C-I. Okay, so that is the winners of those six. I decided to pull a bonus winner um, because everybody is so, so wonderful, and this is such a cute little finish. I, I loved it. I stitched it. I, um, the Heart and Hand November. Now this one, this pattern is also very well, well loved. Um, I'm gonna turn it over. It has some writing on it. It has some writing on it, but uh, it doesn't deter from the, the stitching part and um, it's super cute. Um, and you'll also get some floss drops and a project take that I have made, okay? So the winner of this bonus is Christy P. Christy. And Christy's been with me right from the very beginning. I love it. She has the most, the, the funnest little like icon. It's so bright and cheerful and lovely. I, I'm so happy, Christy, that you won, um, that your name was drawn for this. I do use a random comment picker for all of this. Um, so Christy, message me. You won the little bonus and I will get that out to you. Now remember, I will ship anywhere in the world. Um, I, I was so graciously gifted um, five cups of coffee in my link below and all that money goes to um, shipping costs so I have no problems shipping all over the world um, that money certainly helps and if I have to spend money it's not a big deal I'm not worried about it so um, get me those addresses I have also pulled a happy meal I have not pulled a happy meal for a while and the happy mail is usually when we go over 100 comments. But we had so many comments 
um, that I thought I'd pull a Happy Meal for this video also. And what that is, is it's just going to be a little um, greeting card size um, gift that will go in the mail for you. And that is going to Mary Frenzke, F R E N Z K E, Mary Frenzke. So, Mary, message me um, your address and I will get that out to you. So, lots and lots of winners. I have a fun plan for October. I have a fun plan for October. And I'm hoping to pull it all together so that I can announce it this week in this week's videos. So, but I think it's going to be a blast. It's going to be so much fun. I'm really looking forward to it. So, stay tuned for our next videos. I hope you enjoyed the poem. Everybody take time to stop, look, and listen. Also, to be kind, spread love, and find peace.